Hey guys, good morning. Oh, it's a good afternoon actually. It's a Thursday today and I just walked for a bit and I'm leaving the office now. I have a lot of things to do. I just received my exchange order, same here. So you guys know what it's going to be. There will be a haul coming up soon. Guys, so I'm trying to clean out my closet and so far I've gotten this heap of things I'm not using anymore. Not necessarily not using but I haven't worn most of them for <coughs> over a year. And I have this whatever that I go by that if I've not used something for a year upwards i don't necessarily need it so these are everything i'm going to be giving up there are a lot like a whole lot so i invited my cousin here she's coming here she's like, like she said, said she's coming to shop so yeah once she's done i'll take the remaining to church and give it to saint vincent de paul someone said i should do a closet sale but I believe that there are so many other people that need these things. I have shoes. Most of all these shoes here are going. Like virtually all of them are going. So and yeah, I believe that there are people that need it more than me making money off it. So I'll just give it to them and God will bless me. So yeah, I've gotten one box of things that I'm using and this other box here. I just folded the things inside. I want to then do for these two and some other ones. Hey guys, good morning. Ah, I'm quite sick. I don't know what is wrong with me. My ear has been paining. This half part of my face has been paining me for so long. Like, not for so long. I woke up yesterday and realized it, and it's been the same since then. I want to go get antibiotics, but my mom said I should hold on for a bit and see if I get better today. But I'm a, I'm a bit better, but I can still feel the pain. My eyes, my nose just half like this my ear my throat and i've been breaking out like crazy i don't know what is going on like this is not how i plan to start my january like i don't know and that code i've been having from the village is still there i took activate i took pro code it's still there like i cough i half cata everything i don't know what to do at this point i think i want to just go to the hospital or take very strong antibiotics i'm one not to like medicine and hospitals but at this point i think i should i want to also go and braid my hair today let me know where my problem is coming from maybe all these weeks <laughs> oh my God, i'm just joking but i want to go and braid my hair today i'm in the office now but i'll just do half day and go braid my hair i'm i'm going to use one color that i saw with one girl on one girl in spa some years i think it's like a year ago it was very cute it came out sort of pinkish but it's not pink i don't know how to explain it but i'll show you guys when i get there i don't know how it look oh, because she was a bit light skinned lighter than me actually uh, i'll just try because i like it i was doing um box braid nothing too full nothing too fancy actually just something to make me <laughs> i don't know i just want something different basically and the fact that i have to brush hair every day it's tiring so let me just leave give my um give my wigs a rest and braid so i'm just in the car now and i'm about to go upstairs to the office hope everybody's doing well hi guys hi <laughs> my cousin and my colleague <laughs> they said i was my first and was entered this footage now they've entered <laughs> so i want to tell you guys that i did not end up braiding my hair again I went to the salon and guess what they said to braid my hair just normal box braid bra length they said eight thousand naira <laughs> but girl i just left though because i'm like why would i pay more than five thousand just to braid my hair i was saying hello this one she was like why that her girl can come and braid me and i would even give her like two five buy three packets of attachment one one k three thousand at most six thousand because people told me that she should pay eight thousand. First of all, she has to say nine thousand. I told her no, I don't want big brain. And I said, okay, it's eight thousand. They can do it. Um, that's how I left. Though. So I'm still wearing wig. Any when I decide on who's going to make the hair for me, I cannot see myself paying that amount. I'd rather dash somebody that money than to go and pay for something that I know I can get cheaper. Like it doesn't make sense to me, any sense at all. So yeah, I'm just here in the office. I'll just give you an update. Hi everybody. Good morning. 
this Monday morning, it's, I don't know, I'm indifferent about it as usual, but I'm just tired actually. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about at this point. But yeah, I think I'm going to get malaria and typhoid medicine because the sweats, I've been sweating profusely for these past two days. It's been crazy. Nelly was in my house this morning and she saw it. The fan and AC were both on and I was sweating so bad. So I think I'm going to get um, drugs now. I'm just packed outside waiting for Nello that she went to the ATM to withdraw money. She wants to buy me breakfast. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just waiting for her and after before I go to the office, I'll just go to the pharmacy and get um, drugs. Also, I want to go to Gary's in. I want to go and buy um, license, Windows license. What it means is that the license for my Windows computer. I don't know I, what's the easiest way I can talk about this. The easiest step, but yeah, the license for the Windows is almost expiring. And when that happens, when that is ongoing, when it's almost expired, your system becomes starts to become really slow and eventually it stops working it stops coming on though it stops giving you the windows home page i need to go and get it very cheap actually all those ones are cracked copies though they, are, they go for like 500 between 500 and 800 now so i need to go to what gary's in now and get it and yeah that's about everything i have to do today before going to the office mm. you guys do not believe what my day has been like today it's been so stressful like i did some deliveries for home and co today and I don't even know what the customer wanted is not what I thought the customer wanted is not what the customer said she wanted she wanted another hue of a frame and they are still the same color yeah but I gave a lighter hue and she said she wanted a darker hue although she didn't tell me before before I delivered this but I like my customers being very comfortable so I'm going to take the frame back I'm going to do it again so it's been it's very stressful day I cooked I cleaned I did everything it's Saturday by the way I forgot to add that and yeah <clears throat> my voice is still not back and guys I've been failing on my diet I feel like I've added a couple of kg and yeah another thing I was going to talk about was the fact that I think I'm going to go off YouTube for a bit reason being that I want to write some exams some professional exams YouTube is good but it's not what pays my bills so I have to improve on the one that pays my bill at least till YouTube starts paying me yeah so I wanted to tell you guys that on time. So in case you see that I've taken a hiatus off YouTube, you understand why I took the break, yeah? And yeah. Hey people, <coughs> happy Sunday. Just got back from church now and I'm, yet to, I'm, I'm about to do breakfast for everybody then start lunch. I want to finish everything I'm doing very early today because I have things to do. My car disappointed me yesterday. Like serious disappointment. My car just went on the road and stopped and when I came there I noticed that all the oil from the car fell poured the transmission oil the mechanic when he came he was like God really loves me because that thing can knock engine and my car will just be easily and to replace that gearbox engine there were three hundred and something thousand there and God so I want to take it to the car wash today because it looks very oily and messed up so they can wash it very well but first, I'm going to cook. You guys know the drill now. Normal Sunday food, fried rice, blah, 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 bobo tibo, which I'm very tired of. But I'm going to do it nevertheless. Who am I? So, I just had to check up on you guys and keep the vlog going. Yeah, so today, this morning, on Dima Omi's page, I saw she did a post where she, she asked a question on the 2009 presidential um, campaign debate. And it was such a nice thing. I was so proud of her. Not because I don't know her personally, but the fact that creators are being recognized now. And yeah, we're getting there. So it was a good fit for me and a good achievement for her. So, food is ready. So I told you guys I was making fried rice here. Yeah? So this is my portion. I have plantain, I have sauce. It's goat meat sauce with gizzard and I have my salad here so yeah that's what I'm having for lunch it's actually late lunch because it's almost five o'clock I'm just going to dive into this now and eat come and join me I'm just vlogging because I want to take my mind off the fact that I'm so heartbroken my car stopped me on the road again and this time the oil poured again so let me go to the car wash 
like 10 minutes away from the house and lo and behold that's how my car started checking and next thing went off only for me to come down see trail of oil again that same oil i bought yesterday for five thousand everything has poured again after the mechanic told me he had tightened it i'm tired like i don't even know what to do at this point again i'm pissed i'm weak i'm everything in between but i'm just trying to vlog to just take my mind off the anger i don't know what to do i'm just seated in the car trying to calm down but i'm stranded <laughs> i'm sure by some sort of luck something good will happen maybe someone will meet me or i don't know i just called the driver now to come with the um another car so maybe we can go and get the oil but i'm not even sure we'll get this oil this night because it's almost six o'clock and most stores would have closed that's the ones that opened on a sunday so i'm just <laughs> god that much so i'm not worried i'm worried but i have faith that it will be sorted out what's the thing worst case scenario i'll just park this car on the road and go home hey guys I'm just coming back from work. I didn't drive to work today because my car issues. But the mechanic said he's done and he's on his way here. He told me he was on his way here one hour ago and I haven't seen him. But yeah, he's done fixing it. I spent so much money on that car today. I'm so pissed. But yeah, I just got home. I took a cab. I'm back home and it was a good day, so I can't complain. Hey guys, it's really dark here. I'm walking upstairs. I almost stripped to go and watch Aquaman the movie this movie was released since last year and i'm only just seeing it reason being that it was expensive here in genesis i'm panting because i've been working for so long okay yeah, so it was really expensive here it just came down to the normal price and i couldn't see myself watching movie for three thousand when i'm not eating popcorn or drinking anything so today <laughs> I got it for the normal 800 naira and I'm about going to see it so I'll see if it lives up to the hype and all the buzz I've been hearing about it. I'll let you guys know. Have you watched it before? I even forgot that I hadn't told you guys my thoughts about the Aquaman movie. Remember that day, the day I went to watch it, I told you guys I was going to tell you how I felt about the movie afterwards. I'm, I don't know. I have a very different view from apart from from every other person because every other person seems to like it. They feel like it's a blockbuster, it's everything and more. But to me, I feel like it's just a generic storyline. Like the the rightful heir, heir, I be heir, I be heir to the throne, takes what is rightfully his. Normal thing. Even Nigerian movies have they acted like that. The only thing I was there for. Let me not lie, for this movie is the actor, that guy. Like, he's such a hunk, his body, everything. But besides that, I don't know, I just feel like it's a normal movie. And it was so long because at the end of the day, I knew what was going to happen. So all those rigmar rolling up and down wasn't worth it to my, to me or to me. I don't know about any other person. So, yeah, Heidi Cohn did well. I've never seen her in such play such role. They might she might have, but I've never watched any movie of her playing such a role. And yeah, it was just the norm for me. The norm, trust me. Like I don't know, it didn't blow me away. Basically, that's what I'm trying to say. Hmm? If you haven't seen the movie, in case you don't know, after the movie ends and they're showing the um, um whatever the cast and crew, after a few minutes into that. They show you another scene, like one or two scenes. When I watched the movie, I was the only person left in the cinema. But I knew that Marvel movies always come with um, end credits. So I watched that. So if you have not seen it and you're going to see it, wait till after they write a few names, sing the song. Like the movie is ending, you see two scenes. Yeah? And so let me throw that out there. I'm already on my way to work now. I am maybe late but i was already walking from the house so it's not it doesn't count i'm first going to the park to ship out stuff that a customer got from my store and yeah i'll meet up with nello later nello's son's birthday is on sunday so i'm going to help meet up with her later today to help her with party pack and some other stuff so that's me for today guys i can't remember the last time i had makeup on my face like it's been it's getting to two weeks that i the last full makeup i did was that last video i put up like i've been trying my face like this to walk everything and i feel like it's it's making my face a bit clearer i don't know i don't know but yeah 
the main reason why I'm not even doing makeup is because there's no time. When I come back from exercise, most times I just lie down on the floor and sleep for like 15, 20 minutes to get my body back before going to shower. And I take my time. Like, I crawl like a snail. <laughs> We're at the printing press to pick up books for Kaito's birthday. That's Nello's son. I picked um, books for him as his birthday gift, so we came to pick it up now, and that's what we are here for. Hey you guys, I might not be looking at the, um, what they call it, the lens of the phone because I'm driving. But yeah, I just said to tell, see I'm looking. <laughs> I look like one rich man's wife with my very voluminous hair. I'm on my way to Nello's house for Kaito's birthday. And I'm a bit late, not so late though, I had to cook before coming out, make lunch. And you guys know how dramatic my house is on Sunday. So fried rice, sauce, and the whole shebang. But I'm on my way now and yeah i love how i look i wanted to go for something not over the top i ended up with it that's why i not do eyeshadow but at the end of the day my ombre look lips rather now looks very dramatic i really don't mind though so i'm in stadium road now and i'm close it's going to be fun i be now also told me that one of our friends he's actually my family friend we i know i knew him right from my childhood we stayed on the same street his birthday is today too so from there we're going to be going there and yes i'll show you guys <laughs> this hair makes my face look big what do you guys think guys i'm here i'm just walking down where i parked versus where our house is it's not a distance i'm just lazy like one minute or two minutes walk but cars are already parked everywhere and yeah, I wore that jumpsuit I got from Shane. I'm sure you guys can already tell. This is how I look. I just paired it with a red bag. And... So, this sweet, my aunt said I should give it to her. So, Nello has found love in my auntie's eyes. <laughs> so, I'm only a messenger. Now I'm the middleman between both of them. Happy birthday! <laughs> You're so pretty. I know! Can I see? Hi guys! Hold. Hi mom, see the birthday boy. He looks so different. He just had a haircut yesterday, I think. Hi mom, see. Hey guys. I'm on my way to the next party. I just left Nello's house now. My hair is so big now. Hey, she over. But yeah, we are on, on our way there. The second location is not so far from Nelo's. It's in Gulf Estate and let's go here now. <sighs> but we are here to park. Ibi is in front of my other friend Ami. going to be though it's another haul i noticed that you guys like my hauls a lot and yeah so there's another shane order and a haul is coming through very soon stay tuned how is everyone doing today it's a thursday and i'm going to end this vlog here today reason being that my next vlog will begin from my friend Ugone's son's first year birthday which is on saturday but Tomorrow I'll be very busy. I don't even think I'll have the time to vlog. Ah, see my boo. You yeah, guys see my boo. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here today. But before I do that, I wanted to tell you guys on here that my, I'm going to film a Q&A 
you guys must have noticed by now that I hit 500 subscribers. Yippee! It's a good one for me. Like, I'm happy about it. I don't care what anybody thinks or if people will be saying, ah, she's doing too much. What is 500? 500 is a big deal for me, guys. Because I can remember when I was just 50 subscribers, 30, 100. I was praying for 100. I attained 100, 200, 300, 400, and now 500. And I've surpassed it. So I'm doing a Q&A. So you guys can ask me any question on Instagram. I'm going to leave my Instagram handle somewhere on the screen so you can go send your questions. Ask me any question. No question is out of bounds here. Like I'm going to be spilling everything and do my best to answer each and every question. So you guys should come through, yeah? Come through guys, come through. It's going to be fun. Like I'm going to answer everything like I said before. So yeah guys, this is the end of today's vlog. I losing my hair today against the hair tie. I want to braid it tomorrow, hopefully. So yeah, if you enjoyed watching this vlog, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know your thoughts in the comment section. If you haven't subscribed already, we are on our road to 1,000 subscribers now, so let's make it happen. Thank you so much guys for the love, for everything in general, and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!